Karo Matoma made history last season when, on April the 1st, 2023, he broke the record for most goals scored by a Japanese player in a Premier League season. This season, he again looks better than ever. Signed for £2.6 million, the Seagulls are guaranteed to make a huge profit on their Japanese superstar. Mitoma has quickly established himself as one of the best left-wingers in the league, as a dynamic offensive force who can dribble, create, shoot and score goals, while being an integral part of manager Roberto De Zerbi's fluid, high-possession game. As a winger, you're judged on your dribbling and creativity. Matoma is perhaps most famous for writing his university thesis on the art of dribbling, and on the pitch he lives up to the billing. Positionally, Matoma starts high and wide, like a traditional wide player, as displayed with his goal in the 4-1 win at Everton last season, a strike that showcased his dribbling talent in full flow. Using his electric speed, balance and poise, there's just 4 seconds between the Brighton forward receiving possession and the ball finding the back of the net. Here was Matoma's take on that goal. I could see the space, so I wanted to kick the ball further to create the space behind with my first touch. Then, on the second touch, I was going right to attack with the shot. Here he is drawing in Liverpool's Trent Alexander-Arnold from that wide left position, manipulating the ball and leaving the England international chasing his shadow. He tormented Trent all game in that matchup last season, running at him directly with pace and skill, cutting inside and outside, sensing a weakness and relentlessly attacking the fullback. Mitoma this season already has a goal of the season contender to his name, scoring a stunning solo strike in the 4-1 win at Wolves. Mitoma collects the ball from his teammate, breezes past three Wolves shirts in a weaving run of more than 40 metres and slots a calm finish past the on-rushing keeper Jose Sarr. It's goals like this one that make Matoma so fun to watch. Whether you're a stat head, an analytical nerd, a hardened ex pro, a casual fan, or a season ticket holder, the visual joy of watching a player run through four players and finish with a plum will give you an instant sense of gratification. In Matoma's feces on dribbling, he wrote about using the defender's upper body movement before deciding which way to beat his man 1v1. And watching the tape, it's clear he picks his moves by reacting to the defender's movement. He loves to face his man up 1v1 and take them to the byline. He's also great at drawing fouls. It's here where I have to mention the X Factor for any elite winner, raw pace. He's electric in open space, and because he's so good technically, often leaves his man on toast. That speed allows Matoma to knock the ball a few yards in front of him and catch back up with it before anyone else. He does not bother with step overs, tricks, flicks, he's just efficient, smooth and elegant moving with the ball. A student who has become a master. Couldn't resist. Matoma averaged two successful dribbles per 90 minutes in the league last season and is averaging the same this season through the first month, placing him in the 90th percentile. As a creator, Matoma uses his dribbling ability, the close control and the ball manipulation to get his head up in tight spaces and find teammates. He's composed under pressure and is a fine playmaker. He nearly always plays passes sharp, low and fast, keeping the ball moving. He's brilliant at using that burst of acceleration to blow by a player and simultaneously getting his head up and find the open man with a pass or a cross. The speed, balance and elusive running on the ball pulls players out of position opening up corridors for his teammates, Matoma's playmaking is a byproduct of his dribbling. He already has three assists in the league this season, two off last season's tally of five. Since 2020, Matoma has averaged over 10 goals per season in all competitions. Good numbers for any winger. He's not a goal scorer in the same vein as Bakayo Sako or Mohamed Salah, but he has proven he's no one-trick pony and has a collection of finishes to his resume. Matoma lives and breathes in the inside left channel, finding space in the penalty box and shooting. It's a part of his game he can still improve, adding more goals from these dangerous areas. Brighton sold Moises Casido for more than £100 million this summer. Matoma, as a modern wide player, has all the attributes to be Brighton's next cash cow. After breaking into the team last season, he has went from strength to strength. 
if he can become more clinical in the box and as a goal scorer while adding more precision to that final pass or shot he could become one of the best wingers in world football at age 26 he's still yet to hit his prime years and with his current rate of improvement Matoma has the chance to be the face of Asian football and a global superstar.